So Arm to Farm is our week-long training program for military veterans who are interested in running and operating a sustainable farming business. Arm to Farm, it focuses a lot on some of the farm business, farm financial management side of things. So we really want um, we really want the, the veterans to think about what are their farm goals and you know how can they develop a business plan and how can they set up good record keeping systems and um, learn about USDA programs and accessing those USDA programs. After I retired from the military, I went to the Arm to Farm program run by NCAT. I was put on at the University of Arkansas. I kind of had a vision for the things that I wanted to do on the farm, and it helped me really get a sense of what other resources were out there, and kind of helped me to reevaluate some of the stuff that I was doing. For me, when I attended Arm to Farm, I could just look and go, okay, I need to talk to him when this is over. I need to go see them when it's over. I'd say take advantage of the opportunity. There is something for everyone. It doesn't matter what type of farming I think you, you want to get into. You will get, uh, you will find some nuggets of information that'll, that'll help you further on down the road. What we've seen is veterans make really, really good farmers. Um, you know, they have that, that mission mindset and they aren't deterred by just common obstacles, you know? Being a part of, of, of that group and being a veteran, there's just a, you know, a communal thing so that if you have questions to any of those people, you know, they've, they're in the same kind of boat that you were trying to find their, their place in the, in the world after they get done with their service. So it's all incorporated into everything that you learn in the military so it just kind of goes hand in hand and I think it's it's a great program and it's specifically designed for veterans you know place to come and spend a week and just learn about everything that people do that's working for them that you know that's, uh, whether they're doing it for a living or if they're they're doing it part-time on the side you know it's it's just a good place to come learn things that each of these farmers do that makes their operation work. We hear our participants say, you know, we served our country and we're going to continue to serve our communities by providing good healthy food. You know, we want to care for our families and we want to care for our communities and, and so it's just an extension of their service and you know, they want to do whatever they can to help us and, and help us continue training um, continue Arm to Farm and continue training other veterans because they have seen how it's helped them. And they want to make sure others benefit from that as well. We focus on sustainable agriculture. Really everything on the farm has a symbiotic relationship. You know, the, 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 the cows eat the grass, the chickens fertilize and sanitize the fields, uh, the hogs really help clean up and keep the forest from overrunning everything. That program opened our eyes up to all of the help that's available. Not just uh, the community, the network of farmers, right? Uh, and and Margo and, and the staff up there with what they do, but the grants through NRCS that, that you know, they've got everything stockpiled. Uh, the hands-on farm activities. You, you find a purpose to serve again. That's what was missing for me. So becoming a farmer and producing something that, you know, I could feed my community and, uh, you know, raise my children off the land. And, and this, was, this was my way of, you know, bringing service back.